was a beautiful start to the weekend, Kelly, up to Keystone on this Saturday evening. Just picture perfect, and I still just can't get over how green everything still is, thanks to all that moisture. Today, a cooler start to the weekend. We topped out at 87 at the airport, 82 in Boulder, as well as Fort Collins. 61 today was the high in Leadville, and 79 in Vail. Currently, 82 degrees at the airport on this Saturday evening, 81 downtown. It has been a bit breezy at times, with winds out of the west at 13 miles per hour. On the first alert, satellite and radar we're dry through the Denver metro area right now, but it is a different story down in southeast Colorado where we're tracking a strong line of storms spreading from Lamar down through Springfield, producing quite a bit of heavy rain, lightning, even some small hail out of these storms. This is thanks to that monsoon flow. All of this moisture funneling up from Mexico coming right into the state. We're going to see it again tomorrow. Through this evening, we'll see those showers linger through about 11 p.m. tonight before we see those clear out. Tomorrow morning, a bit more sunshine shine than we had this morning. Then we'll see clouds build back in thanks to that monsoon flow and right around lunchtime showers pop up in the mountains by the afternoon. Not out of the question that we could see a passing shower through the metro area, but we're not expecting any severe weather up and down the I-25 corridor, but down in southeast Colorado Springfield South, we could see some of these storms turn strong to severe. So the severe weather outlook for tomorrow includes Springfield south of Trinidad as well. We could see wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour and hail up to an inch overnight tonight. It's going to be comfortable out there. One of those nights you can just open the windows and turn the AC off. We'll be in the low 60s throughout the front range, 50s and 60s across the eastern plains with 41 in Leadville overnight and 46 in Vail with 48 in Steamboat, 50s and 60s on the western slope. Looking ahead to tomorrow, we'll have a cold front pass through right around 9 a.m. and check out these temperatures for the Sunday. It's going to feel very fall like out there in the 70s from the airport stretching up through Sterling and Julesburg. So very nice wrap up to the weekend. We'll still be on the toasty side down in southeast Colorado in the mid to upper 80s and out on the western slope. We're staying in the 90s tomorrow, so they'll still have those summer like temperatures in the Denver metro area tomorrow. 80 for a high in Denver, 77 in Broomfield as well as Lakewood and 73 in Castle Rock out to Jefferson County. We'll see 66 in Genesee tomorrow and 75 in Golden for your Sunday down in Douglas County temperatures will be comfortable 73 in Castle Rock as well as Castle Pines with 75 in Lone Tree on your super seven day forecast. The cooler weather will stick around on Monday will be in the low 80s and then the summer temperatures will be back on Tuesday will once again be in the low 90s and that warmer pattern will stick around through the end of the week and then by Friday into next weekend that monsoon moisture will be back bringing a better chance to see showers and storms develop.